Not only put that, guys, but anything that you do buy in the item shop, you can always use the code King Alex HDD. I am super grateful to every single one of you person that you guys use this. It really does help me out, and I really, really appreciate it. Thank you so much for using my code in the item shop, okay? And I really appreciate that. Also, guys, every date at 7 10 or 7 5 p.m you guys could come to the community and i will basically show you everything that is now in the item shop in the community all right and then as soon as you click on it you basically will see what is in the item shop only for that day right there guys so yeah but once again guys i'm gonna be giving out some emo and skin in the item shop so if you guys want to be one of those lucky winner make sure you smack the like make sure you're a subscriber and share the video let's get 500 likes in this video right here guys and not only but that but as you can see i'm gonna be hooking a lot of people up with this new emo that came out in the item shop also guys if you're gonna buy anything in the item shop that you're just gonna buy uh the crazy skin or anything like you're just gonna go on your own way make sure you use the code king alex hdd i do appreciate that guys if you guys use my use my code in the item shop and uh, once again in this video i'm basically going to show you all the challenge on how to unlock the flow um the frost squat and also the snowman though all right and once again uh you can also get the pickaxe and everything and i'm gonna show you it's basically like 28 minutes i know it's kind of long but this is all the challenge all right and i give you the best detail as possible and make sure you save it as a playlist or share it with your friend if you have not unlocked this type of new skin these skins are for free all right guys but anyway guys let's get started with the challenge so here we go make sure you smack the like and share the video let's get it but once again guys this challenge right here uh basically it's coming out today at 9 a.m east time you could do it right now as we speak all right if not just wait for it it's basically stoke a campfire okay now the first location is going to be right over here all right and all you have to do is light up the campfire all right which is right over here all right and if you have wood all you have to do is going to cost you 30 wood okay to stoke all right so I'm going to show you um, how to do it. So you can basically pick up some wood. All right. If you guys do not know this, I mean, this is so simple and easy. It's not even that hard at all. Okay. Now, as you can see, that's all you have to do. Just make sure you pick up enough wood just like that. All right. And then I'm going to show you the other location. If you think there's way too much people on that location, you can always come to this location right here. There's another campfire right over here, right, right here, like right over here. You see that right here? All right. And what you're going to do now is basically come over here and light up the the campfire. And then you're going to hold square to stoke or for the Xbox holds X to stoke. All right. So just uh, for the PlayStation 4, just hold, um, you know, square to stoke and just do it two times and you will unlock the challenge. And there you go. That's how you do it, guys. And that's how you get the challenge. So, yeah. All right, guys, so the other challenge is basically deal damage with lever action rifle. OK, so you got to get an action rifle. All right. And I'm going to show you which weapon is that basically they're all around the map. All right. Just look for it around the map and eventually you will find it. There you go. This is it. All right. And once you grab it, OK, that's all you have to do. Just grab it and just deal damage to players. OK, that's all you have to do. Literally just. Two shot is good enough, all right? That's it. Like, if you you, you hit them two times with the action rifle or the, lo the lever action rifle, you should be good to go. So, he's, like, right over here, and there you go. That's 58 damage. There you go. And that should count because I, I, I hit him two times already, and there you go. I got the challenge, 10,000 XP plus a free reward. So, just leave the game, and there you go. You got yourself a free reward. Okay, guys? So, now I'm going to show you another challenge, all right? So let me just show you that right now. Make sure you like it up, guys. Share the video with everybody. All right. And uh, yeah, let me just show you. Basically, play, do, squat with friends. Okay. Now, this, I basically, uh, you know, show you this yesterday, but you do need a friend. All right. But I'm basically going to give you a little bit more detail on how to complete this. So just come over here in this location right here. You see what I show you. All right. And then once you come to this location, all you have to do is jump like right over here and basically eliminate yourself like that boom and then tell your friend to do the same thing all right and then once your friend do the same thing boom 
uh, the match will basically finish and you will basically get one out of five remember you got to do this uh five time okay and then tell your friend to you know replay uh, or to ready up all right and then once you you and your friend ready up um you're gonna spawn in the game and then once again you're gonna do it again and then tell your friend to do the same thing all right there you go boom i'm down tell your friend to do the same thing and as soon as he do the same thing uh there you go that's two out of five you see that and now we're gonna ready up tell your friend to do the same thing all right and then once he ready up we're gonna do the same thing all right just like that and boom that's uh three out of five and then ready up and then that's all you have to do just basically clip you and your friend just have to keep eliminating yourself and there you go and then at this moment uh once you and your friend um you know eliminate yourself you should basically um you know complete the challenge and there you go you were 20,000 xp plus you will unlock the skin if you have done 12 challenge of the operation challenge or the operation quest okay guys so once you basically complete it okay all you have to do is back out and then once you back out you will unlock the pickaxe and not only for that but also unlock the character if you did 12 challenge okay guys uh which i'll show you that later but anyway let me just show you more challenge in top of that all right guys so if you guys have not done the other challenge i'm gonna show it to you right now and though in different matches okay so it's pretty simple let's just go and start up the solo all right and i'm gonna show you step by step and it's so fast it's so fast guys so once again you're gonna come over here to this location where it's a cotty corner you're gonna basically come to this spot right here okay guys that's all you have to do just come to this spot right here all right now once you basically come to this spot right here you will basically look around and as soon as you look right here you will see one of the sneaky snowman though um you know uh items okay so just basically hide right here and there you go that's one out of three okay guys leave the game all right guys make sure you do this make sure you follow my step leave the game okay now you can start up the same match to do it again but i'm gonna make it more entertaining so you could just start up a do you see i just started a solo and now we're gonna start up a do you know just high in one of these and there you go that's two out of three all right guys and now you can actually lead the game all right now once again guys this is super duper easy and this time we're gonna basically start up a squat all right so you just basically jump you could like i said you could start up the same match and it will count it will still count if you want to start up the do again it will also count all right but i'm just like i said you could start up a different one if you want to you could start up a squad all right and what all right guys so once again we're gonna come over here for the last time and then uh once you come over here uh just basically high and there you go that's three out of three and there you go you will complete the challenge okay and once again guys at this moment once you back out you will unlock the spray for free without having no type of problem so at this moment just leave the game and you are revive a player in different matches okay so we're just gonna start up the do all right you don't need to have a friend you could basically um you know uh, just start up the game with a random and as soon as a random is basically down all you have to do is revive them so that's one right there and then you're gonna leave the game okay so uh and then you're gonna start up a drill start this one right here okay and then once you start this one up all right all you have to do is have a player down it could be a random player down and then revive them there okay so that will be two okay two out of three and now you're going to leave the game all right and then once you basically leave the game you're going to go to squad okay so you just basically jumping from one matches to another so like that you could get the challenge okay so the last one will be a squad so we're going to start it up and once again your player or any of the player any random player like i say it does not need to be a friend it could be any player uh just need to be down and just basically revive them okay now remember guys this right here you gotta do three different matches the first one is do revive a player from do 
The second one, you're gonna revive a player on thrill, and the third one is gonna be on squad. So you're gonna revive a player on squad, and you will unlock all it. And make sure to share the video. Share the video with everybody. Please share the video with everybody. I do appreciate that, guys. So this challenge, you. all you have to do is cash a snowy flopper. This is how they look like. I'm gonna show you how to get it on your first try. All right. So once again, guys, this is, this is the location that you need to go on. You know how to get the snowy flopper on your first try yes i said it and um once again once you come over here in this location you're gonna basically graph a fishing hook okay the fishing hook is gonna be right over here all right and then try to find where the fish is at you see how they'd be like a bunch of fishes right there uh, you know just trying to fish right there and just grab it as fast as possible uh once the fishing hook move you grab it and there you go you got the snowy flopper on your first try that was my first try look at that that was easy really easy guys and now um uh, basically uh i'm gonna tell you um the other challenge if you have not done the other challenge i'm gonna show you in this video too and once again guys it is super duper easy you could get it on your first try if you guys follow my step make sure you share the video make sure you like it or let's get 500 likes and share the video you will also get this pickaxe and you will unlock the snowman outfit today all right, so now I'm going to talk to you about the other challenge if you actually did not basically do it. So, yeah. So, this challenge right here, all you have to do is collect gold bars. Basically, you all you have to do is collect 100 gold bar. It's pretty simple. It's not that hard at all. And I'm going to tell you step by step how to do it. Now, once again, just come to this location right here. All right. Uh, right here, there will be an NPC. All right. And once you come over here. Uh, I recommend you to do oh and this is another location with the NPC. Just go anywhere around the map. There are there are a lot of them, okay? And basically you're just gonna go and you know get a bounty, okay? And then it's a eliminate player, you're gonna click yes, like you know, you know. And sometimes the players get eliminated really fast that you just get the gold bar. Sometimes it's that really that easy. It is that simple, all right? Uh if that's the case, uh, you know, and then you, you, you just get this random gold bar because they already eliminated the player. Just go back to the AI and um, you know, do another bounty um hunter so you could go find another player now these are the players this is where the players at you're gonna see a yellow circle on the map just go to that yellow circle and this is where the player that you are basically hunting uh is there so you can eliminate him all right if you do eliminate him you will get 150 gold bar and you will complete the challenge really easy like simple all right so at this moment guys uh there you go i found i finally found the player and um and all you had, like I said, all you had to do is just eliminate him. All right. And there you go. Boom. I got 150 gold bar. And that's how you do it, guys. All right. Also, the, when you do eliminate players, they do drop some gold bar. But they don't drop that much. They only drop like eight gold bars. They don't drop that much. Okay. So that's why I recommend you to do a bounty um, hunter because uh, you get 150 gold bar. But if you do eliminate the players, uh, they will always drop gold bars. You see there's gold bar right there. Uh, and this one, um, like I said, they drop like eight to ten gold bar. So just pick it up, guys, and it will count as your challenge. All right. Also, there's other ways to get, you know, to collect gold bars if you don't want to eliminate no players. Uh, basically, just search for chests, and they will always drop some gold bar. Uh, you can also find a little, um, I'm gonna say a little bank. You just open it, and it will drop some gold bar on top of that. Okay. Uh, but once again, at this moment, um. The best way to get gold bar is by doing the hunting uh, hunt, which is the bounty hunt, and uh, you will get a lot of a lot of gold bar. And you complete the challenge really easy. Some players are really easy, guys. And there you go. And at this moment, just back out of the game, and you should get the reward. Okay. Uh, this one I think is a banner or sticker, and that's pretty much it. But once again, guys, let me just show you the other challenge. Okay, guys. So yeah. So basically, all you have to do is shoot down an opponent structure with X4 Stormwind. These are the structure is like when the enemy builds some stuff, like they build the wall, they build a ladder, and all that. All you have to do is destroy ten of those. All right, guys. But once again, the best way to do this is start up a squad, okay, and basically start it up. All right. Now I'm gonna show you where the X4 Stormwinds are. At. One of them is in this location right here. The other location is going to be right over here, all right? And the last location is going to be over 
here. So you have different place to grab the X4 storm wind planes. I'm going to call them the planes. All right. Just basically get on them. Also, just make sure you have enough gas. All right. If you don't have enough gas, you can always go to the gas station. All right. And then fill them up like this. Make sure it's a hundred because uh, you can fly around the map like for a long time. So uh, you don't have to do this, but I do it because, uh, you know, I could take out the structure. There you go. That's one right there. That's two. And all I had to do is take down 10 of those. All right, guys, that is all I have to do. It's pretty simple. All right. And at this moment, all I'm going to do is just fly around them. All right. So you, you already know I already took down two structure. Oh, there you go. They build another one. That's three right there. And then <laughs> they just keep building stuff. All right. Which I like, though, because I need to do this challenge right here. All right. So as soon as I, I come over here, you just have to destroy the number four, which is right over here. Boom. There you go. Four. All right. And all I'm missing is six more. So um, right now they basically build, they're building a lot of stuff. Okay. They're definitely building that. Basically this challenge is going to be really easy for me. So at this moment, um, there you go. They build more structure. So there you go. That's five. And I got to There you go. That's six. So now I'm only missing four more right now. They build a whole structure. If they do that. Then lucky for you because you will complete this challenge really easy. All right. So at this moment, I'm just going to destroy that seven, eight, nine, ten. There you go. Boom. And that's how you do it. And that's how you complete the challenge. OK, guys. And that is pretty much it. So now I'm going to show you the other challenge, guys, that you have not completed yet. If you haven't, I'm going to show you now. So, yeah. This challenge is going to it's going to call travel 500 meter in x4 storm wind so if you guys do not know what the storm winds are they're basically like in this location right here there's one right over here and there's another one right over here okay guys so once again it is pretty simple all you have to do is just put gas on the x4 storm wind and that's the basically the play i'm, I'm just gonna call it the plane because some people want to know what is a 4x4 um, you know store that's actually the plane guys. All right guys So just basically come to this location right here. This is what the X uh, For win at they basically right here. You see that people are just getting in it and just fly away That's all you have to do guys. It's so simple It is literally so easy and you could go by the gas station and get some gas Okay, because at this moment guys you only got a few you know gas thingy so uh make sure that you go to the gas station and put some gas on this plane okay guys and it's pretty simple guys it's one of the easiest challenge ever i mean let's see the challenge you see there you go you see it's going up you see how it's going up see so simple right 400 look i'm, I'm already like i get a thousand instantly and that's it guys that's literally the challenge it's super duper easy all right all right guys so there you go at this moment um uh, there you go. I'm about to reach 5,000, um, you know, traveling. That's it. There you go. Boom. 10,000 XP. Now, what I'm going to do now is just basically leave the game. And then once I leave the game, I basically unlock the reward. That's it. It's so simple. It's one of the easiest challenge ever, guys. And there you go. That's how you do it. Hey, look at it right there. But, uh, yeah, man. But now I'm going to show you the other challenge you see this right over here you know um if you come right over here all you have to do is come to this store right here you see this store right here all right and just walk inside here you will see the nutcrackers you just have to destroy them there's literally three of them here so it'll be really really easy for you so that's two right there and this is going to be three right here so now i'm going to show you the next location which is going to be over here at salty tower this one this this is the location we're going next okay guys so yeah we just gotta land right over here all right and as soon as we land over here we're just gonna take out one of them here there you go one there you go and then the second one is going to be right over here there you go that's number two right here and there you go that's five basically that's five in total okay there you go, and that's five. And basically, when you back out, you should complete the challenge. So now we're going to see what, what we got. So we're just going to leave and then get the reward. And that's pretty much it, guys. So, yeah. Today is going to be place top 
10 with friend and squad. So make sure that you guys going to start a squad, all right? And you're going to come over here and you're going to start up the squad, click on that and then play the game, all right? I'm going to give you some strategy on how to become top 10 on squad okay first thing first uh make sure that you do eliminate some players all right look at all these players guys i basically had to face every single one of them i went extremely warrior and basically i took every single one of them down there you go look at that boom also another strategy make sure you camp it out go be you know hide it out in the sand and make sure you are like the top 15 you will basically will see it on the right top side okay where the map is at if you are top 15 for sure you are basically on the top 10 so you basically will have to do this three time to unlock this challenge and to unlock this web okay so yeah so once again guys at this moment i am basically on top eight there you go guys if you can see that right there i am officially top eight all right so that's one out of three and then the second one i was top five that's basically two out of three if you guys could basically see that let me just show you real quick this is this is how you know that you basically on the top below top 10 so that's basically pretty cool and then once again you do it the top three uh basically i'm basically on top three and there you go you unlock the challenge all you have to do is basically become top 10 on squad and it's pretty simple and you will unlock the challenge all you have to do is quit the game and as soon as you basically quit the game you will basically unlock this reward it's pretty simple and ten thousand um xp okay so once again guys i'm going to show you the other challenge that you missed from yesterday and before that day all right guys so let me just show you that challenge first oh yeah all right guys so the first location is going to be at salty um, tower just come over here you basically will see a tree all you have to do at this moment is basically dance and that will be the first one so now we're going to dance on the second location will be Preston Park. If you guys come over here, uh, you will see another Christmas tree. So just come like right over here. And uh, all you have to do is once again, just, just keep dancing. That's all you have to do. So just come over here and just dance. Uh, and there you go. That's the second one right here at Preston Park right here. Just basically dance like that. Okay, guys. So the third Christmas tree is going to be in this location right here. Just basically come right here and you will see a Christmas tree right here. And all you have to do is once again, just basically dance do the dancing emo just like that. And there you go. That's your third one right here. Okay, guys. So, all right, guys. So number four is Holly edges over here. Uh, just come to this location right here. You will see a Christmas tree right here. And uh, once again, just do the dancing emo. So just dancing emo just like that and that's number four guys and once again guys the last location is at dirty dock if you guys want to come over here there is a christmas tree right above the building right here in this location and once again guys all you have to do is do the dance and uh you should basically get the spray okay after this so right now once you dance there you go you will basically uh unlock the challenge and now you can leave the game and I like the spray guys okay but anyway I'm gonna show you the other challenge guys if you have not done the other challenge I'm gonna show it to you all right so if you missed the challenge from yesterday um, I'm gonna show it to you in this video right here so do not worry about it I got you all covered up and uh, yeah let's get started so once again guys at this moment this is two challenge you could get two challenge all you have to do is visit the snowman outpost which is over here that's one and you need to collect a chest inside the snowman outpost okay so this is two challenge you get two challenge in one which is pretty cool all right like i said just come visit in this location all right and uh, now i'm gonna show you uh the other location there you go that's two make sure you look around okay this is the other location right here the snowman outpost uh once you come over here uh basically that's the second location and now you're gonna go inside and look for a chest all right also one one more thing i will let you guys know uh there's gonna be opponents inside here so you gotta be careful and there you go the third one is gonna be right over here in this location all right and then we're gonna basically look for chests all right if anything and also let's see do we find any chests inside here 
No. Uh, oh, yeah. That's one right here. Okay. There you go. Boom. All right. So all we miss is two more chests to search inside the outpost. Okay. Uh, the four location is going to be right over here in this spot right here. All right. And once you come inside here, uh, there should be some chests so you can search for it. All right. You can search them. All right. Let me see where is one. Uh, there you go. This one right there. Boom. There you go. And then I'm going to show you the last location, which should be in this location right here. See, that's the last location right here. That's number five. All right. So once you basically make it here, you will automatically um, get the challenge. There you go. Boom. And not only but that, but also search the chest so you can unlock two challenges. And there you go. There you go. You see, I unlock two challenges. So that's that's how you do it. Uh, two challenges for once. Let's go. <laughs> All right, guys. And now we should leave the game. All right, guys, so that's pretty much it. So once again, guys, make sure you like it all. Make sure you all subscribe. Make sure you turn on that notification and share the video with everybody. I do appreciate that. And that's all the challenge that is now available on the Operation Showdown challenge. And that's pretty much it. But once again, guys, hopefully you did enjoy the video. And I'll see y'all next time. Bye.